Hey guys, I'm Francis Booker. And I am Michael Ragusa. And welcome to Under the Hood. Michael, you're not on my side. Let's not. Let's not do that. What the heck, man? Dipping yeah, on Yeah, this is stupid. I don't like this anymore. I'm not having any fun. So obviously we're recording a remote episode with Michael and I. Um, it took us a while to get set up, but we're ready to go now. Are you ready for this, yep. Michael? Not really, but you know, whoever is. What do you think? Did you know is? that Mountain Daylight Time stretches into Oregon? Like, that's crazy. Look at what it is that. It does? Look at them. look like... I already closed I, my clock. Oh, well, that's no fun. Okay. Anyway. We had, to, we had to use an international clock to sync up our audios. It's just... That's not important. You guys don't care. You're here to watch funny videos. Why are you talking true. to me? I don't know. All right. Michael. I have yes. news for you. Okay. One day in the future, your life will end. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. I now, mean... the next question is, what do you want to get done before that? More than this. Uh... <laughs> be a bad time for that to happen. <laughs> Alright, so today we, we're going to be talking about our bucket lists and bucket lists in general and talking about what's on our bucket lists and whether some of the most popular bucket list items around are on our personal bucket list. Alright. Uh, personally, I think my bucket list I think is different than most people because there's a lot of things that I'm like, oh, that, that would be cool. But like, for me, a bucket list is like, this is the thing I have to do before I die. Like, this is something that I will feel incomplete not doing. Hey, I hear you. Um, I haven't really thought about it, frankly. Like, Yeah. There's not, uh, like... I mean, there's, I mean, there's things, the thing is, obviously. I mean, not, I mean not, not to be ignorant, but, you know, we're in our early 20s. It's not really it's true, on the to-do list is to, you know, <laughs> make a will. It's, or it's a weird thought. Exactly. I don't yeah. have a will. Don't kill me, no, I don't will. Okay, so let's talk about some popular bucket list items. So I, I, I did a little Google search. You did. To find some of the most popular bucket list items. Number, a, a one that kept coming up as number one, which really surprised me, was see the Northern Lights. Is seeing the Northern, Northern Lights on Light. your bucket list? Yeah. I mean, okay. Would I like to see the Northern Lights? Sure. Yeah, I'd like to, but like... Exactly. If you were to tell me that a meteor is going to hit the Earth tomorrow uh, at the size of Texas and I can't see the Northern Lights... Mm, all right, you know. Exactly. It's, exactly. It's, that, it, I that's how I feel like... without it. Exactly. That's how I yeah, feel like. I'm not, like, yes, I want to see the Northern sure. Lights, no. but like, I will be fine if I don't see the Northern Lights. Oh, yeah, no, it's not number one by any means. Absolutely not. No. Okay, okay. Yeah. How about number two on this list? Run a marathon. Oh, 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 oh absolutely not. Are you 26.2 miles? Sure, yeah, I'm going to do that. You know what? I kind of... Crazy, a marathon? I kind of want to. Like... I guess, oh. I feel like I almost have like two lists, you know? Like I have my bucket list of things I have to do and then my list of like things I'd like to do. It's not on there. <laughs> it's on my like to, I would like to be the kind of person who would get in shape, train and run a marathon at some point in my life. Absolutely Cause I'm not, not I there I right mean, now. I, would, I wouldn't mind doing like some sort of, you know, athletic at event or like, let, like yeah. I'd love to do a tough mutter, like or like an, one of the really, oh like, yeah, the, yeah, the lawn ones. I would do one of those. I I really want to do one of those, but I'm not running for 26 miles. That is something <laughs> that is. If you told me that, yeah, I don't even know how to describe it. Three hours, four hours. I don't even know how long they go. Like a couple hours of your life just running, yeah. and then like, what do you win? What, what, what happens when you do that? What, what do you get? If you win or if you finish. Um, you get a, you get a hernia is what you get. <laughs> no, you get exhausted not. and possibly have a stroke because that's what, ha what happened to me. Oh, okay, no, so but, right, so again, you're not interested short. in running a marathon. Okay, I okay. I think that's the takeaway from this like five minute discussion. Yep. No, not okay. running a marathon. <laughs> How about this one? A lot of people want to write a novel. 
I forgot to bring my copy of Stand in here. <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't have one in my room either. Buy, buy uh, Stand, our book. It's available on Amazon. It's here in post. Don't it's in do my that. car right now, okay. Um, that one is one that I relate to, though, because... Well, check. Obviously, we, we finished... Well, yeah, we, we kind of checked that off. But, like, if there is one thing that is for sure on my real bucket list, like, things that if I don't finish, I will not feel happy with what I was fin what I got done. There is a lot of stories and books that I want to write that, like, if I didn't get a chance to write and publish, I would be very disappointed with myself. What are you laughing about? <laughs> I'm I was scared. Just, and not, not, not even because of what you were saying specifically, but like, <laughs> I don't even know how to say this. I really don't have a bucket list. Like, not only was that really not <laughs> on my bucket list, like, there's nothing I really want to do. <laughs> if books like, two and three didn't come out, it's no skin off your back. Yeah, if books two and three didn't come out, I'd be like, that's, a sh I mean, it'd be like, oh, man. And then I'd probably move on. <laughs> but no, it's not even See, writing a novel. It's anything. I can't think of really anything right now that I really need to do. Writing a book. Okay. Like, finishing, you know, the first book publishing it you know doing everything yeah. that was obviously great i'm happy we did it but like was it on my bucket list before that probably not but i'm happy we did it though now yeah 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 okay so okay you know what i i know the the, the goal of the rest of this video then is to find you a bucket list item <laughs> Find my first so, item. Find something that I have to do. <laughs> that's so the only thing content. on your bucket list. Make a bucket list. Because <laughs> so, right now I'm very content. <laughs> that's about it. You know what? That's oh, good though. I, I I think that's a better mentality I have to one have. And you know it. What I is have it? one and you know what it is. You know what it is. I don't even have to say it. Just, I'll let you think about it. I'll tell you at the end of the video. G give me a hint. I actually don't know. It's the stupidest thing ever. It's really, really stupid. But it has to do sort of with the hood. It's sort of. Oh. It's, is it is it going is it plausible? Probably not. Is it no. be a guest star on Conan? <laughs> yes. It is more of a joke. Alright, uh, well, you know you know what? You told me that that was a joke, but like I honestly wonder sometimes if you're just <laughs> really serious about it and that is really the only goal you have in life. Could you imagine if that was it? Like if it ended right there, I have no more goals. How great would that be? All right, so let, let's that find you a point. goal that's okay. achievable. Um, Actually, you know what? Be, um... uh, Mr. O'Brien, if you are watching, Michael, his life goal is to be a guest star on your show. And we, if you would send us an invitation, you know, we will be happy to accept. If you, Absolutely. if anyone watching this knows Conan O'Brien or anyone who works on the Conan O'Brien show, pass our pa pass this video along to them. We'd love to talk to them. No one knows yeah. them. Okay. No. Okay, so let's Bring find you a goal. Yeah, go down the list. Yeah, let's let's find you one that's that, that, that is like achievable. You know. Okay. Go ahead. Let's hear some. Are you a skydiving guy? Are you are skydiving a goal of yours? I would love to go skydiving. Yeah. I I think I'm too afraid. <laughs> like, what if the shoot doesn't open, you. man? Like, like, what if I know people do it all every all the time? I, I would love to go skydiving. I'd would you consider it on your bucket list? I think I. If I, I think I'd probably have to. Well, okay. I will say this. Mm -hmm. Up until a couple years ago. Well, maybe skydiving. I think I'd put it on my bucket list, probably. But okay. something else that would have been on my bucket list that I already did is that up until 2017, I have never been on a plane. And mm. if I had to have gone on a plane before I died, okay. No way so I you you, you checked off a plane. bucket list item already. I did. Yeah. All right. So so we yeah. have some bucket list items. For you. I I have no intention of ever skydiving most in my them, entire life. Most of them involve air travel for me so far. <laughs> You do. You really like airplanes, apparently. I have another one, but keep going. I think I have one for you, actually. But what's what's yours? I talked to you about this. I want yeah. to go 
to Barrel, Alaska. Oh, you or did tell U- me. Y- U- Uta, so, it's a new name now. It's like Uta Quip or something like that. Yeah, that northern, really northern port in the United States. It's like it's ridiculously far north, and it, it's like dark there that three months a cool. year and sunny there like four months a year. It's ridiculous. I really so, want to go there. Is that like somewhere that you have to go to? Yep, I have to go there eventually. Okay. I have, to do it. I have another another location that I feel like you have to go to before you die. Oh, I already know what it is, <laughs> and it's on there. Go ahead, tell I me. I know it. what it is, and it's on there. It's um, Normandy Beach. Yep. Right. You have always wanted okay. to go there, yeah. Always, always. You I'm going always. to. So that's, you could even just just, okay. just check it off right now. Even if I die, I'm going to go. It doesn't matter. I'll take I'll your your corpse. We'll transport yeah. your corpse there. <laughs> he look, <laughs> Michael, look, you're here. <laughs> well, that's definitely okay. You know what? We have some pretty you? solid even, bucket list items. We haven't talked about you at all yet. Where do you want, what do you want to do? I mean, my probably biggest bucket list item is these like books and projects that are in my head because they are constantly rattling around in my head and I don't have enough time to do them. And that is really like one that I I, I really like. I actually get nervous that like something will happen to me unexpectedly and no one will ever find out about them. Like I I have. I'm not even kidding you. I, I have like considered Write down, writing. Man. That's what, oh, it takes too it. long to write down. <laughs> like I don't even have, I, I actually have a notebook of some of the ideas, but like it takes too long to write down. And like a lot of them are stored digitally on my computer. And I don't know if anyone besides me really has the login for it. But well, that. Make sure you got some fail safe, put like a binder and like a sentry safe and uh Hide That's the key somewhere. If I were to die, the key to my ideas is right here. Right here. Right. I, I, I genuinely... You know what? You know what, Michael? I'm going to give you the login to all my stuff. You you now know. You are now responsible. I'm, I'm dubbing you responsible. That if I die, find. I will give you the log... I'm going to give you the login to where I keep all my files. I'm going to tell you right now I have a notebook with all my ideas in them. It is your job to get them and find someone or write it yourself. That is your, that I'll is the, do the, the task I'll, I'll I leave try, to. I'll try decently hard to accomplish. I'll make an attempt. <laughs> I'll make an attempt you will, to you accomplish will, your goals. You will make an attempt. I, I will try to think about doing the thing you just said. Yeah. I will do my best and think over whether I would like to do what you told me. So I appreciate that. All right, what else we got? Fans watching this, if ever something happens to me and Michael is unable to do the thing I just asked him to do, please message Michael and see if maybe you could do my things. That would be neat. That is probably my biggest bucket list item though. Yeah, him, yeah, the rest I'll, of the stuff, I'll like, it's stuff I want to do. There's not really a place or like activity that I, I feel like I have to do. Okay, I got you. It's all, so you it's all things like really... personally I need to get done is how I feel. So you don't want to like, if you never went to, you know, Europe or something like that. It's not like on your to-do list. No. no. I'd be, I mean, like, like on some level, yeah, I really want to do it, but like honestly, like if I were dying and I was like, uh, I'm not going to make it to Europe, I it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. My, so it would be like one of those like, oh, that's a bummer, but like I really, I, I wouldn't, like with my last couple days, I wouldn't go fly to Europe. See, mine are a lot travel related, but I'd love to travel to all seven continents. Yeah, that, that's another goal of mine. I'd love to do that. That would be cool. All right, Narcos so you know, a fun one. we have our bucket lists. We do. Mine's part of a lot of travel. Well, yours is a lot of travel. Mine's actually a lot of well, staying at home and working. Oh, but, you, know, you. Yeah? I was going to say, you could put this on my bucket list. I don't know if it really counts, though. Um, I've told you that I want to do this before. You mm-hmm. had. You thought you were with me when I told you this, but we were thinking of two very different, very, like, very different ideas. And I think you know, I'm going to start, and I think you know where I'm going. Okay. I, we live in a populated part of the eastern seaboard. Oh, yes. Very populated. I don't like it here very much. <laughs> it's too many people. I want very, very badly 
to buy a piece of property or, or, mm -hmm. or, or a house on a piece of property, like 50, 70 acres in the middle of like Montana or like Idaho. <clears throat> and I will never tell anybody <laughs> that I own this house, never tell anybody where this house is. And like two to three weekends a year, I am gone <laughs> for like three, six days a year. And I, no one knows at all where I am. And I will sit there in my cabin looking looking at nature and not see, seeing a human being for like three days so that's i, I need to do that that's how i that's like that I, do. I will put that on i like list. that you had a different right, so, when i told you that though <laughs> we did um yeah you know what that just made me realize though and i never realized is in like 10 years time you might just stop saying that to me because you're doing it and you never yeah, told me that you're right. doing it. <laughs> yeah. And like, yeah. it's gonna take me like probably like five years to even realize that's what's happening. I, I like fun it. fun to me, I'd love to do that. Okay. All right, so you know, we have solid bucket lists, I think. Uh, let us know in the comments, guys. Button. What are some items on your bucket list? What do you really wanna get done before you die? Uh, do you agree with our list? Do you think we're absolutely crazy? Um, give us a like, give us a comment, subscribe for more, we post every Friday. And check out the link in the description to find our book, Stan, The Hooded Book One. It's a really awesome book, we worked really hard on it, and if you'd like to check it out, please, uh, give it a look. We'd very much appreciate it. Very much appreciate it. With that, Super though, neat. I believe we are wrapping up. We are wrapping so this I, one up, correct. I've been Francis Booker. And I have been, formerly, last time, I'm Michael Ragusa. And we will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye!